Hello, this is Kimball Wiggins <laughs> making a return video for the Thermal Take V1 build I did with my son Max. Um, did a couple of modifications to it, which I'll go through. Um, this is not a Pentium in there here anymore, it's an Intel 4590. So let's go through and show you a little bit what we did. One of the major things we did here on the side, since there wasn't any dust filters we um, installed our own with some double-sided magnetic tape and that really helped out a lot as you can see I've done a little cord management cable management because it was a real mess when I put together the first one on my video so pretty much what I've changed here the CPU now is an Intel 4590 and I put on a CPU cooler, an Artec Freezer I11. Same components as I had before. Same stock cooler, the big 200. Same motherboard, same GPU. And that's about it. I'd gotten some criticism about my build, how awful it looked, and I just wanted to show you guys that although it was awful in the beginning I've got that was my first build I got put together normally here and um, I want to congratulate anybody who's tackled these V1 thermal takes because they're a little little extra work as you can see you don't get much room for cooling which is one of the preferred methods I think of on these things nowadays is the um, water coolers but there's not a lot of room, so if you're going to fiddle with a water cooler, you really got to know what you're doing and have patience. And um, I hope you guys like this. I hope it gives you guys some inspiration to try out the ITXs, the mini ITX. I really enjoy this one a lot. I can't tell you how cool it is. It's just one of the coolest, quietest PCs I've used. It really helps out this um, 750 Ti. GPU doesn't make any noise at all. I just ordered a Sapphire R9 280X and that will have to require me powering it a little bit differently. This will be some more cable stuck out through here, but it'll still be okay. Anyway, thank you very much and I hope you guys have a good day. Thanks. Bye bye. I'm filming this with my new Y camera. Why I, I pronounce that right. Yeah, here the Y. Everything's in Japan here. Y action camera or Y action camera. I'm not sure how they call it, but really nice little HD quality GoPro clone. Anyway, thank you very much. Have a good day.